All right, good morning, people. Today we're heading off to Kerala. We're going to be traveling general class on Indian trains. Now, everybody tells us to avoid general, but we're going to see what it's like anyway. I mean, it can't be that bad, can it? <laughs> so we need to get our ticket at this little window here. But let me tell you, I've got to say, India has the worst queues out of anywhere in the world. Queues don't really exist. They just form of people bundling around and like pushing their way to the front. It's chaos. Oh, can we see through? Can we get 243? I'm really sorry to make you wait. Oh, it's okay, don't worry about it. Can we get 243 yes. In general? Thank you so much. General will be crowded, it's okay for you. It will be crowded? Yes. Okay, we will just try. It's okay. 70. 70? Okay. You were the lady. This could be bad. And then just Trivandrum. We stay there. We go to Kochuveli. Kochuveli. Okay, Rambanandri. Is it going to be very crowded? Yes. Very crowded, yes. Okay, thank you. Let's find out. Right, here we go, we're in general. The ladies warned us. Let's see how it is. It's only like a two hour train, so I'm sure we can deal with it. As long as it's not super crowded. What platform is it? Um, well, let me just read this tablet. I can't read it. <laughs> so it's um, 35 rupees each person, like 30p for a two hour train. Pretty good. Our train is on platform two. So everyone's just jumping across the track. I can't be asked though. These pants aren't flexible. I've got my bag on, can't be asked. So here's our ticket. We don't know where the general carriage is. We'll have to ask someone. Excuse me, chaps. Do you know where general is? General? General? Is it the, the front or the back? Like here? Yes, yes. Un unreserved. Is here? Okay. So we don't know still. I think they're saying the train is this one, but we don't know where it is, do we? No. We'll find out when it comes and we have to run. <laughs> Jump on. First apartment. Run the first apartment. Front first one. Uh, is it is general good? Uh, okay. Or is it bad? No good. Uh, friend, friend, first. Come. Okay, run and Andrew. Alright. Flipping hell. We're not in for good in here. Here she is everyone, the Pune Express. Well that's not us, that's persons with disabilities, it's this. Well, it's busy but it's not that busy actually. Oh it's going to go right to the end and we're going to have to run after it. It's not that busy. No it's alright. I just saw it looks alright. So yeah, is it this one as well? No it's his sleeper. Oh, better watch the floor, there's like holes in the floor. No, it's only here Leash. So General's down here. Don't look too bad. So hopefully people on it will be alright. So I think you can spot it by these stripes. But this just says second class. SR. Is this it? Is this the one? It's not too busy actually. I'm gonna just sit anywhere leash. Or on top. Oh is there? Oh okay. Landry, thank you. So this is the one everyone, and it's not that busy, is it? There's even places to sit. You can just crawl on top leash if you want. Thank you. Oh, perfect. Should we slide the bags underneath? So there's these on the rear. Okay. Oh, go on, shove it up. Just a bit hot in here. Just doing some furniture arranging. <laughs> Right. Yeah? Okay, here we are everyone. From England. Uh, here. Here? Where are you going? To the To the okay, same, same. So it's... 
but plan on Laudu for like one month and carol a little bit. <laughs> so, off the sleeper. It's the same as sleeper, is what I'm saying. Look, it's just, we've just got the, um, the same arrangement with the beds at the top. There's no side berth or side bed. Can you come out here? Very beautiful. Look alike, look alike. The countryside is so beautiful, so green, like uh, waterfalls, rivers, very nice, very natural, very beautiful. See, it's not too bad. They've actually got a seat. So we'll show you what it's like. Okay. So what's happening right next to me is a lady, a transsexual lady has got on the train and then she walks down and does the clapping and everybody on the train, well not everybody, but a lot of people give them a little bit of money because I've said before they think they are they're like higher beings or whatever. But they're quite chilled in the south. I've heard some bad stories in the north of like the harassing people and doing all kinds of mad, weird stuff. So we met our mate Anthony here on the train. And every time we get on a train, we end up with like an extra 10 places to visit in India because people just recommend so many places. So he's telling us to go to Kota Giri, which is like a hill station, which does look very nice. So every time we get on a train, we end up with 10 new saved towns, cities, whatever. All the time I was here. <laughs> Hello, please come and get one too. Okay. How much is one? I threw him off. Okay. Thank you, sir. All right, we got a little tea. So it's just literally boiling milk, and it is boiling. So it burnt my hand. We're tea bagging. Look at that. We need to. We need to get that um, tea brewed. <laughs> there we go. I know we're on tea bags. Need to make it strong, leave it for a few minutes. So yeah, tea man coming down, maybe there'll be some food coming down. It's raining here. I tell you what, it's less busy than the last train we got where we had a booked seat in the second seating. We've got all the room in the world here, look at this. I mean, the roof is full of fans, but if I'm being honest, none of the fans work. There's one working in this whole carriage near enough. But it is what it is. He's getting there, but it's not quite the same strength. So what we'll do is we'll have a little walk through the general carriage and see what's in here, see what's down the other end. Or oh, the toilets, I don't even know. We're gonna find out, we'll see. Oh, we've got a um, dodgy geezer on floor behind me. It's the toilet. Oh, we just got a decent squatting toilet with probably the worst smell of any toilet on the train I've ever seen. What's in here? I can't do it. Oh, you just slide it off and I can't be asked going in there anyway, so. And then what's in this side? Oh, we only get squatting toilets, people. So, we're not blessed. This smells so bad, like. How can anything even smell that bad? So what's in here? Just another general carriage? What's in here? Oh, that's the flipping engine room. I don't want to be going in there. I'm going to get just kicked off the train. Sorry, everyone. I was just having a look. So we'll go back. Flipping out. Let's pull the door and then I just see the, the driver, I think. I don't know what was going on. So I'll try and show you some of the views. Oh, wow, look at this. Well, now. Nice and green. Hello, sir. Very beautiful. Look at the palm trees. Wow. Are you from here? You go to Trivandrum? No. Just close to here. Okay. All right, everyone. In a minute, I'll try and show you some of the proper views. Here. So we'll try this little brew we've got. Well, it is very hot, but it's quite good. It's very sweet. It's all right. That's the nice milky sweet brew. Look, Indian Railways Cup. So um, people are getting on now, so we'll have to um, all get a bit cosier as we get closer to Trivandrum. Now, our mate Anthony tells us that the train's quiet until Trivandrum, and then at the big cities where it gets like pretty busy. Yeah, of course, sir. Sorry. 
So now we're a bit cosy, and it's all good. Everyone's pretty decent in here, people are alright. Apart from my mate on the floor near the toilet, so I don't know what he's doing. Thinking that maybe he lives there. Honestly. What is your name? Mm -hmm. No, don't worry, it's okay. <laughs> good tea. Mm. Very good tea. Very, very sweet. Tastes <laughs> like pure sugar, doesn't it? I used to make brews like this in England and I get told off because it's too sweet. For oh, YouTube, YouTube. Yes. You want to say hello? Oh. No? You want to say hello? Hi. <laughs> what is your name? Zini. 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 Jansi. Jansi. Wow, beautiful names. Yeah. <laughs> we've got some really nice um, claw passengers, haven't we? Yeah, we've got lucky with this one, haven't we? Mm -hmm. We thought the general train, honestly. We thought we were going to be like this, like, but it's very nice. There's lo lots of room. It's fun. Right, people. Super friends. Super friends. <laughs> we picked, we picked nice, the best nice cabin, the best cabin, yeah. the best berth. We did it. That father also not very good, not like this. No, oh, so many places. No, Anthony is a bit of a legend. He's a clever man, he knows a lot of stuff. Malayam. Malayalam. The language, Kerala language. Achen, Achen is the Malayalam word. Father. 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 Can, can you teach me some Malayalam? Yeah. Can you teach me basic, like, um, hello, thank you? How do I say hello? Like, hello, like um, in Tamil Nadu, Banakam. Banakam. Same, same. Malayalam Namaskaram. 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 That is how we say hello in Kerala. Namaste. In Hindi, Namaste. In Hindi, Namaste. Namaskaram. And how do you say? Well, how do you say thank you? Is same Nandri? Nandri. 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 Tamil. Nandri. Malayalam. Nandri. Nandri. Thank you. And in Tamil, Nandri. Yeah. How do you say like thank you very much? So Romba Nandri. Malayalam. Valara, 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 Nanni, Valara, Valara, Nanni, Valara, 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 Nanni, Valara, 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 it is like um, Ellis, Ellis, not not Alex, Ellis. <laughs> but everyone call me Alex. Wow. Yes, this is me. <laughs> New subscriber. New subscriber, okay. Nani. I've got one How more question. How many subscribers you have? Nearly yeah. seventy thousand. Seventy thousand. It's okay. Just little. Yeah. <laughs> How do we say? Um, delicious, tasty. So like the food is very good. Ruti, ruti, ruti. Paste, paste, paste. Ruti. 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 Right. So when we eat some melty food, we say Uji. There we go. That's usually three basic phrases for survival anywhere in the world. Hello, thank you. Delicious. Namaskara. Namaskaram, hello. Nani, thank you. And then Uchi. Uchi, Balara, Balara Uchi. Balara, Balara Uchi. Balara Uchi is very delicious. Okay. Thank you, ladies. Nani. Balara Nani. <laughs> I've nailed it. <laughs> Professional? I, I sound like. We enjoy very well today. I sound like Kerala man. Yeah, I play Kerala man. In Kerala, do you yeah, eat, eat, do you eat yeah, apam, apam with coconut milk? Uh, coconut milk? Uh, it's good. Apam. apam. Uh, but have you put coconut milk on? Uh, coconut milk. Uh, oh, it's very good. Nice. I wish I filmed that in Chennai. We ate it. The, the apam classic, soft in the middle, crispy on the outside, and then the man would drizzle all this fresh co sweet coconut milk in it, and it like all melted. It was so good. Should have filmed it. So there's no denying the 
southern part of India is extremely green. So nice. Look at these views. I'm trying to show you some nice bits here and there. So where we're heading is Trivandrum. Now, that's the short name that the British gave the place to go in. The actual name is Tiruvananthapuram, which is an absolute mouthful. And I've just finally learned how to kind of say it, Tiruvananthapuram. When a local says it, they say it so easily, like, we are just... Like, the tongue just, like, rolls, rolls the word out, it's a madness. Tiruvananthapuram. Wow. <laughs> The Indian languages are just very difficult, like, just, just the pronunciation, like, there's no tones or anything, but the words can be quite complex, so. Every state, pretty much, like, has, has its own unique language, it's mad. India is a, a very interesting country, of contrast, like, it's like, it's like 30 countries in one. Wow. <laughs> Look at this, people. They're just endless, bright green fields, jungle. So nice. It's also nice just passing through the smaller towns, like the villages, and just seeing a little train station. Just, just get to see people just doing daily life, doing their thing. Ah, just normal everyday stuff. Here we've got a little small town Indian train station. You can see they're just tiny numbers, not much going on. Just like two platforms. And then yeah. Here we are. I don't mind the new trains, you know, I quite like them. People are always really nice. It's always been pretty comfy. We've got a decent amount of room and yeah. I can't really complain. So general class is southern India, which is all right. Doing a bit of a building work here, it's a bit of a mess, but you can see how nice the countryside is. So we'll head back in. We have some biscuits. You want? Sure, yeah. Of course. They're pistachio flavour. Pistachio. Got some pistachio bickies. Sharing's curing, isn't it? Thank you. <laughs> I wonder how they are. Do you like a biscuit? Look at this. Everyone's on them. <laughs> Would you like a biscuit? <laughs> yes. Yeah. What? what about this chap on the end? Excuse me, sir. Would you like a biscuit? <laughs> okay. <laughs> I think we've got just enough pickies for everyone in the bear. Look at that. And a couple extra. Oh. You can't beat a good biscuit. Very nice. <laughs> Are we here? 200? Okay, we get off now. Five minutes. Sounds very good. When it's an airport next to a train station or a bus station, they never do that. They purposely, I'm convinced, they purposely build them as far away as possible. I'm, I'm convinced. Thanks, God, for meeting you, friends. Lovely to meet you, ladies. Thank you. National and international. We got one good. Father. I got Anthony, legend Anthony. 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 <laughs> so this is us people, we're in Trivandrum. Yeah, it was lovely to meet you ladies. Social server. Very happy that we came here. Yeah. Yeah. Ellie said, let's go down there. I said, no. This is the best I birth. Yeah. That's the best birth on the train. <laughs> oh, sorry, go on. You are not getting off. Oh, you're getting off as well. Let's get the bags, eh? <laughs> Put our bags under the chair, didn't we? Down here. Thank you, Leash. Oh. Okay. Anthony, it was very nice to meet you, yeah, sir. Yeah. Okay. All right, let's get off a minute. Wow, you can see it's very busy. There's like a million people trying to get on. Oh, gosh. Heavy rush, yeah, it's very busy now, isn't it? 
So you see now, there's quite a few people trying to get on, and this lady's helping us get off, the um, police lady. Okay, but they are lads. Let's wait our turn. Oh, the hell. Right, so, you can see there's a lot of white. Why do they do that? Come on, like, let people get off before you get on. It does me head in. So here we are. The dream team. Very nice to meet you. We now actually have to get another train, I think. Either another train, auto, bus, to Cochabelli, which is like 20 minutes away, where we're staying. So here she is, the Dean Dialu coach. General. I'll say my thoughts in a minute, we'll just say goodbye to everyone. What are they doing? Are you going to work now? Yeah. Yes. We will go to Kachi Kachi Valley. Kachi Valley. Oh. Okay. Okay. Are these people are going to help us now. Because everyone, without asking, is just naturally super kind and helpful. It's fantastic. So everyone's going up in the lift but you know me, I'm flipping eight lifts. It's gonna be very busy, no? Oh, gosh. Will we fit in? Will we fit in? Room for another one? One more? Gosh, only just. I'm in. It's a This is my worst nightmare. At least he's scared of lifts. I don't like them. <laughs> Because Alicia's been stuck like for hours in the lift. Namaskaram. Namaskaram. Give it a hell out here. I'll tell you what, people. Ginny is an absolute legend. She's making sure we get to where we're going. We just asked all the auto drivers how much. And she said, no, I will arrange. She's going to find a way for us to get there. So she's asking people, buses, autos, whatever, should I find us the best way to get to where we're going? Really nice woman. I keep saying, you can't say people don't look after you. It's a tourist here. Really look out for you. Okay. This bus. Yes. To, uh, east to Fort Elton. Okay, okay. Hi, I'm Okay, lovely to meet you. Okay, goodbye. You're so kind. Nice to meet you. we just um, <laughs> held up the traffic, didn't we? He's coming with us. Yeah. Anthony is officially the nicest man in India. Let me sit over here. How much is the bus? You paid? Oh. Three million. Three million. Are, you, oh, are you sure you want us to pay? Oh, thank you so much. It is official, Anthony is the nicest man in India. The hospitality that we have received in the south has been like next to none. It's been amazing. So here we are, people. Kerala, God's own country. Apparently, one of the most beautiful states in all India. Here we are. Feeling good. Right, we're gonna change bus. Selfie? Okay. Okay. Okay, cheers mate. What the hell? Selfie on bus. So we gotta change bus here. It's a madness. I don't really know what's going on. You know when you arrive in a new place and you just don't you like an headless chicken, aren't you? You're vulnerable. Look at this. King Anthony is here. Waving buses down for us. He's the leader of the pack. Look, he's the main man. Wow, these buses have been bashed up. He's literally the main man here. King Anthony, I'm calling him. Oh, sorry, man. What's this? Where did you Oh, gosh. No, thank you, sir. God, why am I looking at that? These people are selling helicopters. Why would I ever want that? That's like the most useless thing on planet Earth. Wow, what's this bus? Why can we flip in London with double deckers? Can we get on this one? Fancy, in it? Oh, we are getting on this one, are we?
Twenty. No. It ain't the double decker bus, unfortunately, but King Anthony is not gonna stop until he's put us on a bus going towards our hotel. So let's see. So this bus goes in the right direction, not all the way, but a bit close, and then we have to walk. So. Thirty rupees. Thirty. Yeah, perfect. Okay. Thank you so much, Anthony. Thank, Thank you so much for helping. Thank you. You are such a calm man. Thank you. Best of luck with everything. Okay. Thank you okay. so much. We have your email address. Yes, I save your email. Okay. Thank have a wonderful day. Okay. Bye. 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 Oh, thank, thank you so, so much. much. How nice is he? King Anthony, the nicest man in India. He's paid for our bloody bus as well. Wow, this is tight. Look at these seats, it's like, it's like a roller coaster. You need a bar to go down on us. How oh, nice, Ray. That was so kind. He just stopped every single bus. He ran across the street, stopping the traffic, shouting, Chevelli, Cochevelli, everyone. <laughs> Make he just a got on a bus just, just for us. I know, he's such a nice guy. He's gone out of his way. We were like, no, you don't need to, Anthony. And he's, he wouldn't take no for an answer. Look at this view. That is a beautiful temple, beautiful gold temple. Might have to check that out. Another day, wow. So, Trivandrum, first impression, just walking through, it looks all right. The layout looks a bit different. Yeah, it does. It, it seems a bit less dusty, to be honest. Yeah, less dusty, maybe. The air looks a bit clearer. I'm excited to eat some Carolyn food. Mm -hmm. But actually, when we're going to check in now, we're going to take you along, show you the room, and then hopefully we can get some Carolyn lunch and show you that. And then we might head to the beach, show you a few churches, and call it a day. Wow, well, the hospitality today, that general, imagine I'm there this morning saying we're getting general, it's going to be a nightmare. People are saying it's a nightmare, it was absolutely lovely. We, we met the nicest people on that train, everyone on the train was decent, nice people. So that was the cheapest unreserved class. So here's what I think. The southern north of India, chilled out, lovely place. I think in the north, the trains must be hell, because everyone keeps telling us that they're hell, that it's really bad and like congested and people don't have any respect or whatever. So I think it's a good job we're in the south. We like it in the south. <laughs> Everyone was just going to work on that train. It was just like a normal commuter train. Yeah, just decent normal yeah, people, like so working class train. people. So yeah, that's all I'm going to say. If we're in the south, travel general. It got a bit busier at the city, but it was still not that bad. Yeah, let's have a peek out the window quickly. Sun's out, gun's out. Alright, see you when we get off this bus. Okay, thank you sir. So, bus driver, being legend he is, just said, a bus had just pulled up next to us, it's going direct to near where we want to go, so get on that one. This one here. What a kind gent. Cochevelli. Cochevelli? Okay, thank you, sir. Nani. So here we are, different bus. Let's see. 20 rupees for this is just a peanut, peanut um, bar. Okay, okay. We'll have it, mate. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, sir. Nani. Oh, gosh. Sat on my bag. So. This is like the women's bus, everyone's a woman. We've got a peanut bar, Aravin sweets. Look at that leash. Done it? Do it now. Should we crack it open? Brecky. Brecky. So yeah, here we go. These buses are like saunas. I do like this peanut sweet. These peanut bars they're doing in India are fantastic. It's like broken up into um, chunks, I think. Oh, there we go. Super. Oh, what's the word for delicious? Uji. 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 Delicious. Super. Tamil. 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 Oh, Malayala. Malayala. Tamil. Okay. I'm just trying to tell him the word for delicious. So, lady stores in Carolan language. Carolan dead ears. Uji. Uji. How does Uji? Uji. This costs 46 for two people for like a 20 minute bus. Right. 
think it's impossible to find yourself on a quiet bus here in India. They're always like this. Even. Always. Yeah, I'll see that. Pull the bell. The bus man's a stop, yeah? Yeah. Here we are, everyone. Woo! That was one busy bus. Wow. Very, very busy. Quite and down towards the end, but yeah. So now we've got like a 10 minute walk through these little back streets to where we're staying. Flipping Darude Sandstorm. My eyes. Right people, we've just checked in. I'm going to give you a quick room tour, but before we head in, let me tell you, we've paid 13 quid for this place and we booked this through Airbnb. Now we never use Airbnb, but we do sometimes when we do, we use it to go behind Airbnb's back, book direct, how about that? But yeah, in India, in a few places, Airbnb seems to be like it was 10 years ago before it became a disgusting company. So here we go, this is what 13 quid gets you on the outskirts of Trivandrum. Let's head in. Now, Gotta say it is very nice. And the second you step in it's very cool because ha 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 we have an aircon and a ceiling fan. So you could never be hot in this room even if you tried. So yeah, this is fantastic value, 13 quid. Like some place in India we've paid 20 quid for no Wi-Fi, no aircon, and like brown tea stained pillows. So here we go. We've got water, give us some waters, a little desk. How thoughtful is this? We've got some soaps that'll make our skin glow. We've got some Indian toothpaste. Shampoo, conditioner, dove, baby. Bed. So right, it's a hard bed. I like a hard bed. If the bed's too soft, it's no good. Asia has converted us. Wardrobe, nobody cares about that. Bathroom. Well, it's all right. Should we check the water pressure? That's all right, though. That's all right. I'll do the job. Well, oh, it's clean, very clean. You can't really ask for out more. Clean, your basic amenities. So there we go, that's what 13 quid gets you. So we're starving. Let's head down the road in this little local neighborhood and see if we can get some food, some fish maybe, or anything, just some rice, some proper food. Look at this, we even got a little rooftop area. Quite nice around here, isn't it? Oh, we've got a hawk, an eagle, some crazy bird. It's quite nice, isn't it? Look how green it is. So you might be thinking, why are you staying here in the middle of nowhere? And my answer to that is, why are you not staying here? We're only here for a few days, to be fair. We're close to the airport, and we just wanted some peace and quiet. And I think we're gonna get that here, because it's really nice. We're just in the palm trees. We've got a little robe, we should have some local shops, food, drink, that's all we need. We're easy going people. So yeah, let's get some lunch. And last but not least, here is our room key. Check this bad boy out. I love Jesus. Would you look at that? Right, let's go. Vamanos. Small key. Small key? Yeah. Thank you. Small keys for the gate. Thank you. Just a nice piece of residential area, look to this lady's house. Who we're sharing with. Hey now then people, see this? I can't read it, but I can see the picture. This is a restaurant, there's some food here, some meals. And it looks open, there's people here. Get in. What a spot, yeah. Just in the flipping back streets. What's going on? Got a big pot in the yard of something cooking away there, look at that. Wow. Should we have a look inside? Oh yeah, proper little spot. It looks all right, this. It's a bit dark. Hello. Hello, how are you? Should we go in? Yeah, well, it is what it is. Hmm? Right. 
right, here we go. It is a bit dark, so I hope you can see the food when it comes, but it looks interesting in here, doesn't it? Super proper local little spot. Some water, fancy bit of a drink. Oh. Thank you. Nani, is this, you call this uno caicho? No, it's not something else. We use our hands, don't we? I would have seen it, we talked to the ladies on the train. I told the name of something we had to try, so we'll have a meal in this area. But here we go, this looks fantastic. So, what have we got? Some different veg dishes. This pickle? Pickle? Okay. And then we got a massive pile of rice and a little pop it on. Okay, yes, please. Oh, what is this? Oh, okay. So it's going to be good, whatever it is. <laughs> this rasa. Oh, so they got four different things, right? Do you have uh, fish? Fish, fish fry. Fry. Fish fry. Fish fry. Fish fry. You have. Can we have a little bit? Okay, perfect. Yeah, don't worry. Yeah. So we're also going to get a little bit of fish for our fried fish, which will go here, won't it? Great. Do I put this on here? Wait, which one do we put on here? This one here or no? This is a This is my lebat, lebat, Oh, this smells very good. Can we just get one? We'll share it. Okay, thank you. Please, do you want one as well? Yeah, go on. to share that. We'll just share this. Okay, just this. Okay, Nani, just this. Yes. yes, no, this is okay. No, 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 it's okay, it's okay. We will share. <laughs> we share just, just one. <laughs> okay, I'm making a right mess of this. Okay, super. That's everything, eh? Yeah. Right. I'll give this a quick try then. I don't know where to start. There's all kinds of stuff going on, as always. I think first we should start with some of the fish. Because the fish does look very good. You can see it's been fried nicely. I don't know what in. It smells good. Get a nice chunk of the fish. That is very good. You've got to be careful with the bones. Charlie did a bad job of them. I won't carry it away. It's nice, that one. It's not like the crab, isn't it? It's super like, very little and healthy. Mm. Honestly, I never know what to do first when you get these meals because you get like five different things to eat. I'm just going to try this rice, it looks really good, it's that thick rice again, for that short puffy rice. It's very good, it's very filling. And whatever she's put on top, it's fantastic, there's little chilies in there. Speaking of little chilies, what are these? She's giving us these, I don't know what this is. Another type of chilli. Which is dried and it's super delicious, that's well done. I don't know what all this stuff is. <laughs> Doesn't matter though. We can still enjoy it. You know it's actually kind of the best part of it because you don't know what anything is, it's all exciting. I'm probably the worst one on the planet when it comes to reviewing these foods because you know you can't pretend you know everything. But you can see the various different dishes here. And all I can tell you is they're very good. This pickle especially. The pickle. That's very good. When you eat it with everything else, let's try this dish here. Let's see how it is. Very good. All the veg dishes are always very good. What's this? Like cabbage? I don't know. Cabbage and cabbage. Delicious. Super. You can call it Mariana Avian. Okay. Tovalen. Okay. Or chutney. Oh, but in English, what is what this is inside? It's all mixed with the vegetables. Special. Is that yeah. coconut? This coconut mixing. Yeah. Oh, wow. Also coconut. Also made by the coconut. Oh, wow, okay. That is like Carolyn's yeah, style. Yeah, yes. Yes. Very delicious. Very delicious, sir. <laughs> Thank you. So, my mate, someone always appears who speaks good English, don't they? Everywhere you go. To help out. So, in Carolyn, they use a lot of coconut and everything. I'm guessing because they have abundance of coconuts. As you can see from outside our room, there's coconuts everywhere, palm trees. Mm. Yeah. Oh, I think the jar is very good. It did really good. 
can really taste the coconut and all the fish fishes. As soon as I ate it, I was like, wow, that tastes really coconut. And the fish is well, the fish is really delicious. It's fried, so it's crispy, but not oily, it's salty. Perfect to have with that rice and all. Oh, amazing. So this fish curry. Yeah, fish curry. Fish curry. Oh, amazing. Thank you. I've got some fish curry as well Thank now. Thank you very much. Look at that. So let's mix a bit of that in with the rice. This has become really messy, hasn't it? But we'll give it a little bit of a mix up and just try it quick for you. It smells no, strong. Have been here. Oh, today we've just arrived. I know. How long have we been staying here? Today is our first day Today's in Kerala. Our first day. Yeah, first day. Ah. <laughs> our first day, first meal in Kerala. Yeah. <laughs> This food is very good. It's light. Coconut. Yeah. Very good. Right, enough of this. Got a little kick to it, yeah. See you after. We're going to get some curd to end the day. Oh, Thank you so much. Thank you. So there we go. Curd rice to end the meal. That looks very rich, doesn't it? Looks intense. Mix all this in. Right, there we go, look at that. Should we try it? It looks serious, this looks heavy. Right. Wow. Mm. That even tastes sour. It's like, it's a funky yogurt taste. What do you that? It's like, it tastes like it's good to be gold. That's exactly what I was thinking. It tastes like your gut is happy, which we can't be complaining about. So here's our hand washing station for when you've finished eating. Just a big jug of water with a lid on. So Alicia's gonna help. Now you would do this yourself, but I'm just filming, showing you what it's like. So there we go. Sorted. How was that? Pretty good, that, wasn't it? I'll tell you what, that, I'm absolutely stuffed. So see how much it is. I think it's only 80 rupees each. Have a look. I'll tell you what I will do, I'll have a drink of water because on the table we've got these boiling jugs of water and these just like communal cups for everyone. So there we go, nice and hot that. Let's have a little drink. How oh, do you drink this or do you do the, the juggling trick? I can't really do that trick. Oh, I've got, a, I've got like a bit of a tree in my drink. Oh well. It's alright, tastes a bit funky actually. Oh well, absolutely stuffed. It's impossible to eat one of these places and not be stuffed. Thank you, sir. Nanny. It was very good. Puji, puji. Very delicious. What's that 140? 80. 80. 220. Okay. 220 rupees for his ball. Have we got it? Are we having a change crisis? Thank you so much. Thank you very much. Goodbye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Goodbye. What a little spot. Right. So you're not going to see us now until later on in the day. We'll check out the beach near us, the big churches. Until then, we're having a nap. Let's get a cold drink. What have we got? Oh my God. God has answered my prayers. We've got stings. Blue sting and red sting. Oh my gosh. This is the best day of my life. This stuff is crap. There she is in all the glory. She's beautiful. Sting blue currant. Limited time flavor. 20 rupees. Hello. Geezer. Absolute geezer. So we've nipped out to check out this beautiful church just down the road from us. We're going to head around to the front and show you, right on the beach. But I've just realised, we've got some bins. But I think they're just for the candle stuff. This is 
is just these little candle chambers. I'm hoping this beach is clean. Because we've seen some bad beaches here in India, so fingers crossed it's not as bad as elsewhere. Beautiful that church. It's absolutely massive. So what we'll do now, as the sun is setting, is check out the beach. Now I can already see it's a bit of a mess from here, so I have no hope for it being a nice clean beach, unfortunately, but let's take a look anyway. And yeah, it's absolutely disgusting. For fuck's sake, fuck me. Why do people do this? I don't really know what to say. It's an absolute shit tip. It's a mess. It's awful. Wow. So I walk down to sea anyway, but you can see the beach is just covered in shite. It's beyond me. It's beyond me why people do this, but yeah, it's like Mad Max all over again. It's such a mess. It would be incredibly beautiful as well if people looked after it, local people looked after it and they didn't do that. Why would you ever do this? It's just plastic beach. But do you know what I mean? It would be incredibly beautiful if it was looked after this amazing beach, palm tree backed, that beautiful church. What a shame. So here we go, sunset. Lovely sunset. And yeah, this bit of the beach, so the actual seafront is lovely. Look at that, it's beautiful. If we just cut out all this shite, it's lovely. Really nice. Really nice, to be fair. Look, the sea's rough. We're gonna have to get feet wet, aren't we? Lovely. Right. I don't know what more to say. I can't be asked for these beaches anymore, they're pissing me off. I can't pretend it's beautiful when this is what we're faced with. Jeez. Right, so that's a um, good and bad end to the travel day. We've had a decent day, haven't we, to be fair. Thought it was going to be terrible, but it turned out to actually be great. Met loads of nice people. Had some good food, it's been fun. And yeah. I don't have anything left to say, to be honest. I'll just be mourning, so. Oh, it's just gonna be loads of rats everywhere.